line of drug development, identification of disease targets plays a very important role in healthcare. To determine the target of the disease, you must know the general condition, the potential, and the problem of disease control based on the protocol of disease control and environmental health program of 2015 to 2019 by the Department of Health Republic of Indonesia. The priority group in drug development is a contagious disease that can be transmitted directly to other people. Examples of diseases are HIV, AIDS, tuberculosis, and influenza. The second priority is animal-borne diseases, such as malaria, dengue, rabies, and avian influenza. The target structure is a protein, either a receptor or an enzyme or DNA that can be determined and can be identified using a bioinformatic device or pharmacologic activity. If the structure of the target is known, for example, determined by X-ray crystallography or NMR spectroscopy, a drug molecule can be determined that can fit properly into the binding sites of the target so that we are able to simulate to prove the interaction between the drug and its target. A software for simulating drug interactions with these targets has been widely developed including Tripos Sybil program, MSI Sirius and Insight 2 molecular modeling software. Test the target and confirm its role in the disease after choosing a potential target. Scientists must show that it actually is involved in the disease and can be acted upon by a drug. Target validation is crucial to help scientists avoid research paths that look promising, but ultimately lead to dead ends. Scientists test absorption, distribution, metabolism, excretion and toxicological ADME or tox properties or pharmacokinetics of each lead. These studies help researchers prioritize lead compounds early in the discovery process. ADME tox studies are performed in living cells, in animals and via computational models. To begin looking for a drug, they search for a molecule or lead compound that may act on their target to alter the disease course. If successful over long odds and years of testing, the lead compound can ultimately become a new medicine. Structure Activity Relationship SAR is the relationship between chemical or 3D structures of molecules and their biological activity. SAR analysis allows the determination of the chemical groups responsible for generating target biological effects on organisms. This allows the modification of the effects or potential of bioactive compounds. Identification of pharmacopher Pharmacopter is a set of steric and electronic features necessary to ensure optimal supramolecular interactions with specific biological targets and to trigger or block biological responses. The pharmacophore model explains how multiple structural ligands can bind to common receptor sites. <laughs> Evaluation of drug safety usually consists of standard animal toxicology studies. These studies usually include assessment of drug exposure, primarily parent drug plasma concentration. 
in metabolite identified in animals that is not present in humans can mean that a toxicity observed in that animal species attributed to the metabolite may not be relevant to humans. Finding safe, effective medicines has always been the goal of the pharmaceutical industry. Better understanding of the biochemical mechanisms for diseases has improved the scientific basis for drug discovery. Along with others such as high-throughput screening, combinatorial chemistry, and microarray technology have required significant capital and human resource investments before the capture of clear value in productivity.